All right, in this question, we're going to do the bin question. All right, hey folks, welcome back. Welcome back. This is question number two, and uh, I've written uh, the important stuff up on the board here, so uh, here's what it looks like. So it says, a developer is going to build a four-story building that uh, will house storage bins. Uh, each floor will be 400 feet by 600 feet. 20% of each floor must be set aside for elevators and hallways. And then it says each storage bin is 10 by 20 feet. Uh, how many storage bins can the developer create to rent? All right, so this isn't real super difficult. By the way, they've been asking this question on that test forever. I took my first real estate exam in 1987. And this type of question was on the question uh, on that exam back then. So this this question been around a long time, folks. All right. So a couple things to look at. If you look at it from an outside standpoint, it's going to be a building, four stories. All right. So I've got that written down. I got four stories, and then it says each floor is going to be 400 by 600. So I'm going to take the 400 by 600, and I'm going to find out how many square feet do I have to work with. And let's see. So that's going to be 400 by 600, and that's 240 thousand square feet. So there we go. We got uh, 240,000 square feet, but that's not all because there's four stories. So I'm going to take that 240 times four because there's four floors on this building. And so that's going to come out to 960,000 square feet. So now if you just had this building with no elevators or anything taking up any other space, you've got 960,000 square feet total. So it tells us in the question that 20% is going to be set aside for elevators, etc. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that 960,000 square feet and I'm going to multiply that times 0 0.80. And again, that 0 0.80 is because I've got 80% to work with because you're using up 20% for an elevator and some other stuff. Now, it says here that each bin is uh, 10 by 20, so we're going to figure that out in just a second. But 960 times 80% is 768,000 square feet. So that's how many square feet I got to use. All right. So these uh, storage bins are 10 by 20. So that comes out to 200 square feet. So each one of these is 200 square feet. So we've got these, these bins are 200 square feet. We've got 768,000 square feet to work with. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take that 768,000 square feet and I'm going to divide that because I need to find out how many I can get in this 768,000 square feet. I'm going to divide that by 200, which will give me 3,840 bins. All right. Now, folks, that's the bin question. There's a good chance that you might see that on your state exam. Real good chance. They love to ask this kind of question. So, again, you take what they give you, take everything they give you, what they're asking, and work it that way. All right, so good luck. That Again, that's the bin question. That's question number two on our practice exam on our website. So make sure you check that out at www.climberrealestateschool.com, and that's where you will find this under resources. And good luck, and enjoy.